Hey, it's Richie from Connectable here. Uh, a few people have been asking me how to create this profile picture that I've got where there's a ring and my picture of, well, the picture of me overlays that ring a bit. Uh, so I'm going to show you how to do that today in Canva. It's nice and straightforward. You'll have to bear with me as this will be an unedited video. So if I stutter, then, well, it is what it is. Uh, so I'm going to head over to Canva. I'm going to create a new design and then here going to hit edit photo. So here I've got a picture of me. Um, this picture actually does have a white background on it. So I want to remove that background. Um, and if you've got a different background, I'll show you how to do that too. Uh, firstly, I'm just going to shrink the picture a bit because I don't want it becoming a background picture. Uh, and then I'm going to centralize it in Canva uh, just here. Uh, towards the top left, there's an option to edit the image. So I'm going to do that and then you can see background remover. So I'm just going to click that and it's going to automatically remove the background. There is an erase button here after as well, which becomes visible. So if you'd like to fine tune it and get rid of any uh, additional background bits that maybe Canva hasn't picked up, then you can do that using that button. Uh, now in the bottom left, I'm going to hit apply and that's going to apply the no background effect. I will now head over to Elements, and here you can see I've got a few semicircles as those I've recently used. Um, this one has got a nice little fade on it, so I want to use that one. Uh, I'm just going to rotate it so it's at 90 degrees, and then I'm going to draw it out a bit so it's a bit bigger, and then see where it sort of overlays my hairline just as it does in the picture on LinkedIn. So I think that is about here. Um, and then what I'm going to do is recolor it. So I know I want these two colors in. Or I think I actually might have used an even brighter one. Yeah, I think I used that pink there. So what I'll do, I'll have that. And then I'm going to duplicate it. So if we go on here and copy and then paste, or you could just control V, whatever, uh, rotate that one round. And you can see here, it matches up, but of course the colors aren't quite right. So we just need to go on flip. So towards the top, we've got flip and you want to flip that vertical. Sorry, I forgot, I forgot that I rotated it. So once we've done that, we can see now it's, it's starting to look where, you know, just about where it needs to be. Uh, this one is currently overlaying me. So what I'm going to do is just click on the picture of me and on position, I just want to bring it forward one. Um, if it brings it forward over the others, just play around with these, bringing them forward and sending them back until it looks about right. Um, you'll notice here when I zoom in that there's just a tiny thin line of a gap. Um, that's just because Canva hasn't lined it up quite correctly. So I'm just gonna bring this up ever so slightly. Um, it's, not, it's not pixel perfect, so a graphic designer might argue with you, but, uh, it will work very well for your social media profiles. So once I've done that, just go to the top right, this picture of Richie, you can go on the share button, click download, and then just save it as a PNG, that's absolutely fine. So I'll download it now. And then there you go, you've got your picture. We could head over to LinkedIn, um, click here, click on edit, and then obviously upload that picture that I just did, or you just did. Um, if you want a different background on this whole thing, then you just simply go into backgrounds, I might add as well. So here we've got a recently used one. I've just thrown that. So it's it's just something a bit different other than white. Uh, it's entirely up to you what you do. Um, you might want to use something that's on brand. Uh, but that's pretty much everything for this video. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comments and I will come back to you.